In this class we are going to discuss about BCD subtraction. Generally BCD subtraction can be easily carried by using 9's complement and 10's complement subtraction process. In this class we will discuss 9's complement subtraction process. In the next classes we will discuss the remaining 10's complement subtraction process of 2 BCD numbers. So, in 9's complement subtraction of 2 BCD numbers we have to follow some steps. That steps includes for example, if you are subtracting any a minus b, I already told you in the last classes, b is said to be subtrahend and a is minuend. If, you, if a and b are two BCD numbers, when you are subtracting a uh, minus b, that is b from a, b is said to be subtrahend and a is minuend. The steps of this 9's complement BCD subtraction includes like this. The first step we have to take is take 9's complement for subtrahend. We have to take 9's complement of BCD subtrahend. Here we need to take 9's complement for this B. The second step is add it to the minuend. So, here by using BCD addition process we need to add the 9's complement of B to A. So, after getting addition result, you have to see the result. If the result is invalid BCD, then for correction we have to add 6. What is meant by invalid BCD? In the last classes we discussed that invalid BCD is nothing but if the addition sum exceeded 9 or got carry. If you have got carry or exceeded 9, that is said to be invalid BCD. If the result, the range is in uh, within 9 or did not got any carry, then that result is said to be valid BCD. So, after uh, getting uh, addition result of these two subtrahend and minuend, you have to check for correction. If there is any corrections, you have to do corrections with the addition of 6. So, after that, after correcting your errors, you have to see the carries, you have to follow up the carries to the next bits. So, in the initial itself, we are not follow up the carries. At last, we have to follow up the carries. After carries follow up, if there is any end around carry, then you have to add that end around carry to the result. Why? Because this is odd complement process. This is nice complement process. Whatever the process we take in, at last is there any carry is generated, then definitely we have to add that carry to the result. Once again see the steps, take 9's complement for subprahend. So, add it to the minuend by using BCD addition. Especially I am clearly saying you have to add by using BCD addition. BCD addition means you have to add the corresponding bits. You are not giving the carry to the next bit at the initial bit itself. So, this process can be better explained by using this example. See this example, subtract 81.2 from 98.3. That means you have to do 98.3 minus 81.2. This is the subtraction you need to perform. Here what is the subtrahend? 81.2 is the subtrahend. And 98.3 is our minuend. The first step is take 9's complement for subtrahend. So, take 9's complement for subtrahend means for 81.2 you need to take 9's complement. 9's complement means subtracting each and every digit from 9. So, 9 minus 2 7, 9 minus 1 8, 9 minus 8 1. 18.7 will be the 9's complement of subtrahend. So, for 18.7 nine, uh, if you are taking 9's complement means, so for 81.2 if you are taking 9's complement means, you have to write BCD code for 18.7. So, here I am taking 9's complement for subtrahend in BCD code that is for 1 separately, 8 separately, 7 separately. 
for 1 so you are writing triple zero one point for eight one triple zero point for seven zero triple one this is the bcd code for nice complement of our subtrahend clear first step is over the second step whatever minor end is there for that minor end you need to take bcd as it is and you have to add for this nines complement of subtrahend so here our minor end is 98.3 this is our minor end i am taking bcd code for this minor end directly so what is the value equivalent to 9 one double zero one is the value equivalent to 9 so point for 8 so again one triple zero is bcd code for h so here so here we are not having any point here only you are having point so here point for 3 so what is the bcd code means double zero double one this is the bcd code for 3 so we take in bcd code for both minor and, and nines complement of subtrahend so definitely we need to take bcd code because we are doing bcd subtraction so see here generally after getting this nines complement and minor and bcd codes you need to perform addition here so 1 plus 1 0 with carry 1 1 plus 1 plus 1 1 with carry 1 here 1 plus 1 so here 0 with carry 1 again here is 1 so see here so this is 1010 10. after that 0 plus 0 0 0 plus 0 0 0 plus 0 0 1 plus 1 0 with carry 1 that carry we are taking here this is carry in this corresponding bits addition you just keep like that don't give that carry to the next bit in bcd subtraction process so when you are taking corresponding bits addition if carry is generated up to a while you just keep that carry as it is because if carry is generated in bcd addition that is said to be error bcd you need to correct that so that's why don't give this carry to the next bit until after correction so here i am taking next bits corresponding addition so one plus one so they are uh, there 0 with carry 1 0 plus 0 plus 1 this is equal to 1 and here 0 plus 0 0 here 0 plus 1 1 so here this is 1 bit this is 1 bit and this is 1 bit so this is these two corresponding bits addition this result is these two corresponding bits addition these two or added and got the result like this now we have to see so added we added by using bcd addition second step is completed now we are in this third step if the result is invalid bcd then we need to go for correction see the result is invalid or valid bcd when we will say add, uh, valid bcd if the result or corresponding bits are in the range of 9 that means below 9 or equivalent to 9 then we can say correct bcd or if carry is not generated then also we can say valid bcd but see here the first bit is invalid bcd because 1010 means 10 it exceeded 9 means invalid bcd here second bit second bit is also invalid bcd why because so we got carry due to this carry problem you got invalid bcd so third bit third bit in the addition result also in invalid mode because the value is greater than 9 so that means this is also equivalent to 10 1010 means greater than 9 so this is also invalid bcd so in this problem all the bits are in invalid mode in some problems while doing another problems you may get a problem for one bit or two bits for that only you need to take correction whatever bits are in wrong for that bits only you need to take correction in this problem you got problem for all three addition result so for correction you need to add six for each and every digit so i am adding six here so see here i am adding six here means zero plus zero zero 
वन प्लस वन जीरो विथ कैरी वन अगेन वन प्लस वन जीरो विथ कैरी वन सो वन प्लस वन जीरो विथ कैरी वन सो इफ यू गैट कैरी इन दि करेक्शन स्टेप आफ्टर करेक्शन इफ यू गॉट कैरी देर वोट बी एनी प्रॉब्लम इन दि फस्ट स्टेप ओनली यू हाव टू सी फॉर कैरी प्रॉब्लम इन दि नेक्स्ट स्टेप आफ्टर करेक्शन इफ यू गॉट एनी कैरी नो प्रॉब्लम एट आर you can follow up that carries to the next bit you you got carry you just uh, keep that carry as it is so go for next bit so 0 plus 0 0 0 plus 1 1 so 0 plus 1 1 and 0 plus 0 0 and you just take that carry as it is go to third bit so 0 plus 0 0 1 plus 1 0 with carry 1 again 1 plus 1 0 with carry 1 1 plus 1 0 with carry 1 you just take this carry as it is next if the result is invalid b c d you corrected by adding 6 this step is also completed now go to fourth step shift the carry to the next bits so whatever carries are there that you just shift to next bit i am adding this carry to this bit i am adding this carry to this bit whatever end around carry is there that i am adding to last bit so i am i am taking these two steps at a time so that means whatever end around carry is there i am going to add to the result so here the result is so 0 plus 1 1 so that means triple 0 1 here i am adding carry means so 0 triple 1 so here i am adding this carry means triple 0 1 again so here you are having point right so here the result is 17.1 this is the bcd subtraction result we will cross check this actually so what we have to do 98.3 minus 81.2 this we have to do we done by using bcd subtraction so 3 minus 2 we need to get one here we got one here so 8 minus 1 you have to get 7 you got 7 and 9 minus 8 1 17.1 you have to get as subtraction bcd subtraction result same result you got here so this is how we have to perform bcd subtraction by using nines complement process